Fox Hunt UK. There's a lot of danger on London's mean streets. You've got gangs, drugs, unemployment, youth, all kinds of shit. The kids are f***ed up and it's getting worse. Even here in the big city, you can't escape the call the wild. We're here on the edge of London, in the dark, mean streets. Ouch. Ah. I'll be taking you down the dark streets and into the urban, wild spaces where the war between man and wolf goes on unseen. I'm talking London, I'm talking youth, I'm talking foxes, I'm talking urban fox hunting in UK. Massive foxes that rodents that I hate. If my mate don't die, wouldn't be out here hunting them. We're talking about war! Against foxes, it's a major war. Just a couple of seconds ago, we saw... Look there, there, a fox! A fox. Okay, we're, we're running across a darkened field in the middle of the night, and I, I see no sign of the fox at all, and... Uh, it's gone. It's... It's gone. I've met up tonight with a leading member of a London youth subculture known as Urban Fox Hunting UK, a dangerous offshoot of the artificial gang culture that has become endemic to British youth today. The Urban Fox Hunters are highly secretive, violent and paranoid. Clark has agreed to speak to me only at the risk of his own life. With his help, we're going into the back alleys and urban green spaces of London. You do have a map, don't you? Yeah. And to lift are... the lid on society's bins and see what's inside. Massive. What is it you've got against foxes? I mean, they've been, it's been banned out in the rural areas of England. Why are we suddenly now faced with an upsurge of, well, urban butchery of vermin? Because they're just rodents. Would you say that you're one of the older members of this group? Is it mostly a, a youth thing? Mixed thing. People who hate foxes come out, take them out. Here we go. Into the, uh, the dark and woody side of London's mean streets with one of its darker and more woodier members. What is the professional opinion on, on, on the status of the fox, is it? Is it a cat or a dog or some kind of twisted hybrid? A very vicious and ugly cat. Oh, here's another layer. Heard it here, folks. A vicious and ugly cat. You two were telling me earlier, Clark, that you had um, known them to drag off small children. Is that true? Could be. Well, they could eat a sheep. Could be. A grown sheep. A fully One grown sheep. sheep. Like a python. Like a python, dragging away a small child in its belly like Santa dragging his sack. That's the fox. These are the methods of the master fox hunter. A piece of wet polystyrene, a large torch, that squeaking sound you hear, that's the sound of a rat in its death throes. Not literally, but that's what it sounds like. Alright, okay, this is, this is incredible. Five minutes ago, five minutes ago, we actually saw a fox. How big would you say that fox was, Clark? Size of a... Shetland pony, maybe? Ooh, a bit smaller than a that. A Falabella, which is the smallest horse in the world, folks. They smoke crack, they go around teething, jocking people up with knives, guns. Foxes form gangs and, and carry knives and to use the street parlance, juck people up. Foxes, they're rodents that I hate. You heard it first here, folks. Not only are foxes not dogs, but some kind of rodent, but also they're on crack, they're in gangs, and they want to juke you up big time. Someone's taken the fox. Another hunter, perhaps? Yeah. All right, okay, so we might have some competition out here tonight, folks. Yes. A stick. Is this perhaps some kind of sign? Yes. Fox hunter's been here. Possibly the same fox hunter who disturbed the uh, the den that we yeah. discovered earlier. Dust to s and this is uh, this is a uh, we're seeing it live here, folks. We're seeing the secret signs of the urban fox hunting UK movement as this uh, urban wild man marks yeah. the message to show that it's been read. So the foxes were lying low here, folks. This is one of their rat runs, one of their tunnels, such as the Viet Cong used in the, well, in the Vietnam War. VC foxes. It's like 
Well, if I'd ever been in the Vietnam, I'd probably be having a flashback right now. Clark, were you ever in Vietnam? Nope, but I worked in Iraq. But you worked in Iraq during this conflict or the previous one? Previous one. And did you see anything in those horrible brief months of bulldozering helpless Iraqi civilians and soldiers in their trenches and homes, just burying them alive with giant bulldozers, which is the tactic that the British Army and the American forces employed, whilst playing very, very loud, offensive rock music. From that kind of horrific slaughter, did you take any, uh, any lessons that you apply to the urban fox hunt? Yeah, I used to go around shooting the dogs that had rabies and they were running around roaming the street. You heard it here folks, that's where British tax dollars go. That's where British and American tax yen go folks. Paying soldiers to shoot dogs in Iraq. I've just been warned to silence. We're approaching the lair of a fox. This is Urban Fox Hunt UK. We're very silently approaching what looks like some kind of open sewer. Um, yes, like the rivers in Beijing, folks, this place looks ecologically dead. This fetid pit of human stench looks like it could support no life within its black bowels, like unto the pit of hell. The deep mysticism of the urban fox hunter, folks, older than witchcraft. Wear this and it'll give you good luck. I'll pass it on to you, my friend. I th yep, I think you're in the zone. Keep it on, and you, yeah. you too could join me with the fox hunting tonight. You saw it first here, folks. Passing on of a sacred relic of the urban fox hunting tribe. The hunting cap, which appears to be made out of some kind of rabbit. A rabbit that was cool. By a fox. Urban fox hunting. UK. Have it! Okay, we spotted a fox and we're we're chasing it slowly. I can't see it. Are, are we chasing the fox or are, we, or are we running away from it? I don't understand. Where's it? Gone down there. Urban Fox Hunting UK. Massive. Weasel. Every time I kill a weasel, I cut myself. Have it some! I have to use my fucking knife on that weasel! That's when you know you're a fucking murderer! A fucking weasel killer! That's horrific.